friends, it's good to see you. You caught me just as I was putting our snack into the oven. Do you see what I'm heating up? What do I have here? Pretzels. These will be ready in just a few minutes. Do you have any idea why I'm making pretzels today? Well, let me tell you about pretzels. A long, long time ago, pretzels became a common food during the season of Lent. Have you ever heard the word Lent before? Lent is a time when Christians prepare for Easter. It's a time when we think about the last days of Jesus's life in order to get ready to celebrate the day Jesus rose from the dead. Lent is a quiet season. It's a time for us to reflect on Jesus's life and on our own lives. It's a time to think about the ways we follow Jesus and the ways we could follow Jesus better. For a long time, people thought of Lent as a time to give up things they enjoy because it would help them focus on everything Jesus gave up for us. They even gave up things that made their food taste good. Things like meat and milk and butter and eggs. Here's where the pretzel comes in. People used to make pretzels from very simple ingredients. Just flour and water and salt. All things Christians could use during the season of Lent. For this reason, pretzels became a common food for Christians to eat during Lent. But there's another reason that pretzels make a great snack for the season of Lent. It has to do with the pretzel's shape. Think about the shape of a pretzel. Is there a way to make a pretzel shape with your body? Give it a try. You all probably came up with a few ways to twist your body into the shape of a pretzel. But this is how I make a pretzel. I use my arms. Do you see how my arms make the shape of a pretzel? Can you do that too? A long time ago, Christians would fold their arms like this when they would pray. What do you do with your arms when you pray? Maybe you press your hands together in front of you. Maybe you hold your hands out with your palms facing up like I do when I pray and worship. Now you can try folding your arms across your chest like a pretzel when you pray, just like Christians did a long time ago. Do you remember what I said earlier about the season of Lent? Lent is a quiet season. It's a time to reflect on Jesus's life and on our own lives. Lent is also a season of prayer. It's a season when we spend time in prayer so that we might grow closer to God, so that we might follow Jesus more closely. That's the real reason I'm making pretzels. Today is the first Sunday in the season of Lent. It's the first Sunday in this season of prayer. And what better way to remember the importance of prayer than to eat a pretzel? Speaking of prayer, let's say a prayer together. Repeat after me. Dear God, thank you for the food we eat especially pretzels. When we eat pretzels, help us to remember the importance of prayer. 
and to pray for your world and all who need loving care. Amen. Maybe you and your grown-ups can make some pretzels during the season of Lent. Whenever you eat them, remember the importance of prayer. Be well, friends.